the difference between spending and saving money. Oh great, another boring day of school. I wish I'd stay home today, but no. I'm not getting used to riding the big school bus, but I am making sure I get used to it. This sucks, Bodhi. Aren't we supposed to go to school on a Saturday? Sabina, are you nuts? We can't go to school on Saturdays. Well, I see the school bus down the road. But it's Saturday, Becca, isn't it? Nope. It's Thursday. It is a school day, and as a matter of fact, the school bus is here now. Good morning. Alas, having to work. Luckily, Germer, you can play at home all day. I'm not playing, Sabina. We are going to school and I trust you to behave. Can we at least play Dungeons vs. Dragons or Grottos and Gremlins? No, we are still going to school and that's final. Hey Angela, do you work, or do you play? I'm going to be working really hard today. It's almost Thanksgiving break, and for period 3, I chose an elective, which is life skills. Next semester, I will choose railroading. What do you do in life skills, Angela? Money investing, cleaning, and watching Howcast videos on YouTube. That's definitely work, that's for sure. Hello, I see, we have Evelyn, Crystal, Melissa, Rolani, Sasha, Bree, Sage, True. Jasmine, Darren, Clarible, Heather, Alyssa, Natalie, Alexandria, Mehmet, and Melina in here today. Today, we will learn about saving money. Oh come on. Do we have to? Melina, this is all about personal finance. Do you wish to gamble all your money? So you better pay attention to this topic. Fine. We all want to save money. And whether it's by denying yourself that $4 mocha latte once a week or putting off an exotic family vacation, everyone has their own way to save. Use these money-saving tips to generate ideas about the best ways to save money in your day-to-day -day life. Evelyn, what's one way to save money? Eliminate your debt. If you're trying to save money through budgeting but still carrying a large debt burden, start with the debt. Not convinced? Add up how much you spend servicing your debt each month, and you will quickly see, once you're free from paying interest on your debt, that money can easily be put into savings. A personal line of credit is just one option for consolidating debt so you can better pay it off. Melissa, what's another way we can save money? Set savings goals. One of the best ways to save money is by visualizing what you are saving for. If you need motivation, Set saving targets along with a timeline to make it easier to save. Want to buy a house in 3 years with a 20% down payment? Now you have a target and know what you will need to save each month to achieve your goal. Use region savings calculators to make your goal. Crystal, what's another way we can save money? Pay yourself first. Set up an auto debit from your checking account to your savings account each payday. Whether it's $50 every two weeks or $500, don't cheat yourself out of a healthy long-term savings plan. Rolani, what's another way we can save this cold hard cash? Stop smoking. I do that all the time, which is a good thing. No, it's certainly not easy to quit, but if you smoke a pack and a half every day, that amounts to nearly $3,000 a year you can realize in savings if you quit. According to the Centers for Disease Control, the percentage of Americans who smoke cigarettes is now below 20% for the first time since at least the mid-1960s. Join the club. Thank you Rolani for the statement. Bree, can you give another example? Take a quote-unquote staycation. Quote-unquote? Those quotation marks are stupid. Malina, this is your warning. Two more and you are going to Principal Kiara J. Wolf's office. Sorry. Good. Anyways, though the term may be trendy, the thought behind it is solid. Instead of dropping several thousand on airline tickets overseas, look in your own backyard for fun vacations close to home. If you can't drive the distance, look for cheap flights in your region. Check airline websites like Frontier, Allegiant, Spirit, Breeze, which is new, and other airlines that have low fares. Sage, what is another way we can invest our own money? spend to save. Let's face it, utility costs seldom go down over time, so take charge now and weatherize your home. 
Call your utility company and ask for an energy audit or find a certified contractor who can give you a whole home energy efficiency review. This will range from easy improvements like sealing windows and doors all the way to installing new insulation, siding or Energy Star high efficiency appliances and products. You could save thousands in utility costs over time. True, what's another way? Utility savings. Lowering the thermostat on your water heater by 10 degrees Fahrenheit can save you between 3 to 5 percent in energy costs. And installing an on-demand or tankless water heater can deliver up to 30 percent savings compared with a standard storage tank water heater. Are you serious? I will have no freaking hot water if it happens. Malina Buchanan, this is your final warning. You are skating on thin ice. If you make rants about my class and this topic, you are going to Mrs. Wolf's office, Missy. Sorry, again. Good. Anyways, Sasha, I'm sorry I missed you, but can you provide another way we can save our money? Pack your lunch. I do that all the time. Thank you for the statement you gave me, Sasha. Anyways, an obvious money-saving tip is finding everyday savings. If buying lunch at work costs $7, but bringing lunch from home costs only $2, then over the course of a year, you can create a $1,250 emergency fund or make a significant contribution to a college plan or retirement fund. Jasmine, what's another way? Create an interest-bearing account. For most of us, keeping your savings separate from your checking account helps reduce the tendency to borrow from savings from time to time. If your goals are more long-term, Consider products with higher yield rates like a Regions CD or Regions Money Market Account for even better savings. And finally, Darren, what is the last way we can save money and not spend it all away? Annualize your spending. Do you pay $20 a week for snacks at the vending machine at your office? That's $1,000 you're removing from your budget for soda and snacks each year. Suddenly, that habit adds up to a substantial sum. Open a checking account online today. Need help deciding? We can help you find the right account for you. Now that we've gone over this topic, we'll do a fun activity on the smart board, and I found it on the Wayback Machine. It's called Mad Money. Hey Ben, have you had a busy day? Yes. I've been working very hard in Ms. Windsor's biology class. We've been learning about plants. We've been working very hard too. We've been taking turns browsing through the neighborhood on what stuff we want to buy and what the budget is to get the big ticket items. <laughs> Goodbye. I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> okay, now that school is over, I will get the daily newsletter from Tails London Gardens Real Estate and the weekly Dish Girls newsletter while you guys get settled and we'll take turns playing Just Dance 3. Sabina Mia Reese. I can't believe you stole another student's notebook at school, claimed it as your own, and got suspended. You know that violates rule 2.11 in the school handbook. That's it. You are grounded until Breeze Airways starts service. That means no Dungeons vs. Dragons, no Grottos and Gremlins, and other things you like. You will be forced to ride the only route on Breeze Airways, which is from Charleston to Tampa, when they start service. Go to your room right now. A breeze. For your information, Breeze Airways has already started service in real life. And Sabina gets grounded, along with Broward gets grounded, Brevard gets grounded and Melina gets grounded will premiere on August 16th, 2021. More changes will come into effect for Keylopolis Entertainment on August 14th, 2021. Blooper videos and funny signs videos will be requested by appointment only when school is in session. Just like the street lights lit this town Like a fire in a blaze, gotta burn it down Can't be afraid to leave this out We got this far, don't know